G'day and welcome to this week's video. With all the news around Facebook, I thought it'd be worth commenting on um, the, the platform itself and from an investment perspective, whether what's happening at the moment is going to be horrendously bad news longer term or not. Um, but I think it's worth having a look at some of the stats first. At the moment, there's 2.13 billion active monthly users on Facebook. Um, this is for fourth quarter 2017. So the penetration um, of this platform and uh, and as we see people around us, um, you know, it's it's always heads down, whether it's uh, walking down the street or whether it's at a uh, at a at a meal with friends or family, it, it's still face down quite often. Um, we can debate the uh, the social appropriateness of that. Um, there is one point one five daily active users. On average, people spend around twenty minutes uh, on their Facebook uh, per visit. Um, and look, they're using yeah, their phones, mo you know, phones mostly PCs. When it comes to the likes and share buttons that you see on uh, websites across the board, there's around yeah, 10 million websites that are viewed daily that have these shares and likes on it. And the photo uploads around 300 million per day. So this platform has been extensively used. Obviously, the news that's come out about it with its uh, obviously the breach in data and the privacy issues are, are significant and of concern. Um, we've heard recently that you know they're making um, you know turning 20 pages where you can control how your data is used. 20 pages are going to be consolidated into one to make it easier to control. Um, what apps uh, have access to your information and, and so on. So you've got tighter controls over um, you know, who sees your information and, uh, um, and what, what access they've got to it. But from an investment perspective um, and from a, a marketing perspective, there's no doubt there's no stronger platform out there that uh, you know, what Facebook know about us is, is extensive. They obviously know where we live, they know our age, they know our gender. And because of the clicks and what videos you've watched and uh, articles you've read, they actually know what your interests are. And this becomes really important for, for marketing people, that if they know what your interests are, um, that if you're keen on, on, on horses or you're keen on betting, um, and I meant riding horses, not betting on them, but it can be both, um, but you can be targeted in terms of what ads you'll see on your newsfeed. And from a marketer's point of view, this is extremely powerful. So while this, there's going to be regulation that's going to make things tighter and, uh, and Zuckerberg and friends will need to change the way they do things to conform and work in with, with privacy and, and fairness around people's data, I don't believe the platform is going to go anywhere. I am a shareholder of uh, Facebook and given what's happened in recent times, um, obviously the share price is down 20%. For my mind, it, it makes it more of a buying opportunity than a, a panic and sell opportunity. So interesting times, uh, there is no stronger platform to, to reach people, to reach the right people from an advertiser's point of view, from the right age, the, the male or female, where you live um, and what your interests are. I can't think of anything that's as precise as that uh, where we can be as targeted as we want. So I think from that point of view, while a few companies have come out and said, well, you know, we might uh, you know, put on hold our, our advertising on this platform, I don't think that'll last. I think it's integral to many marketers uh, and marketing companies around the world. So just my views, uh, time will play out to see whether we're right or wrong on that, but I don't think Facebook is going anywhere. They know too much about us, which means that is very valuable for advertisers. And uh, I believe their revenue growth might cop a bit of a short-term blip, but longer term, it's a strong platform. Thanks for listening. Uh, give us a thumbs up uh, if you like the video. If not, give us a thumbs down. Uh, please subscribe to the channel. And uh, yeah, I'll uh, have one further disclosure. Uh, I'm not on Facebook. Um, my business is, but personally I'm not. I just don't have the headspace to put the time in. Thanks for listening. Catch you soon. Bye-bye.